Wide areas of the state of Kogi in the north central region of Nigeria are under water after the Niger and Benue rivers broke their banks. Flooding began in late September when hundreds of homes were damaged in areas of state capital Lakoya and Ayaoku to local government areas. At the time the state government prepared schools to house some 10,000 victims and temporary camps were opened to house others. Since then the governor of Kogi State, Yehia Bello, has confirmed that flooding has affected the Nilgas, which lie along the Niger and Benu rivers, namely, Likoya, Kogi Koto, Oyaokuda, Ofu, Igalamala Odalu, Basa, Ida, Abaji and Omala. The governor added that Abaji is almost 100% underwater while the rest range of the affected areas are around 30% flooded and upwards. Other inland Lgas also have some degree of flooding from smaller rivers and tributaries. With the help of national partners, the state government will provide shelter at various internally displaced persons camps, as well as security, food, medicines, clothing and cash grants for necessities, among others. In the long term, we will need to gear efforts towards more sustainable solutions where possible. On 4 October 2022, Nigeria's National Emergency Management Agency reported an unprecedented flood in border areas of Kogi and Inugu State. In Uzo Manilga of Inugu State around 35,200 people have been affected, 53,800 hectares of farmland submerged, along with houses, roads, bridges and public facilities, schools, community health centers markets and places of worship.